I'm just going to try and match these up because I didn't do a very good job with it the first time. I just want to move that a little bit that way. That a little bit that way. One there, so that's one, two, three. Okay, let's do the next two or three then. To use my strokes, click till it goes yellow, left click and drag, left click and drag, left click and drag. Whoops, don't think that met. Control Z gets rid of it, left click and drag. Uh, it's going to neat those up a bit. Oops, what was on there? I don't know, but I didn't want to do it. I think it's just gone particularly white, which makes it difficult to see on this model. Okay. So I'm going to use my strokes now to get my horizontals. Press enter, that will fill them in. And uh, just point some faces. Right click in the middle. Move these around a little bit so they nice and neat. The other thing you could do, of course, is you point some faces, you can just left click, left click, left click, left click. It's a matter of preference as far as I'm concerned. If you like doing it this way, that's fine. If you like doing it the other way, that's fine. Whichever you feel you have more control over, really. Whoops. Yeah, try and bring those over a bit. And don't worry if you're getting poked through and such like at this stage. It's not an issue. We'll sort that out a little bit later. Okay, so I'm just going to join those last two up. I'm going to move that across a bit. Move that over a bit. Uh, point some faces. Left click, left click, left click, left click. Right click, right click, right click, right click, right click. Left, 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 left. Right, 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 right. Sound like my dad now. Army man, you know. Add another one there. Whoops, wrong button. Wrong button again. Okay. So at some point in time, we're going to have to kind of create a crutch area here, aren't we? because otherwise uh, it's all going to come together. Um, what I'm going to do to start with uh, is just create a very thin poly there. Oops. I'm sorry, my fingers are getting mixed up there. Uh, there we go. So in here then, um, I want to create a, a bit of a split so that it uh, goes off in two directions. So I'm going to create one there. And then hopefully, if this works nicely, uh, I'll create one in here. It's not being very cooperative with me, so it's just a question of finding the tool that uh, will do it nicest for us. Uh, strokes usually works. So I click till it goes yellow, there it goes, press enter and it will fill it in for us. And we'll just continue that until we get to the back. If you notice there I've got all sorts of things going on there. Uh, we really, really, really don't want that. Uh, I've made whole models before and then found I've got random vertices all over the place. So if you do get that, really press escape to get rid of it and then start again. 
see, I've got it again. Uh, scope. It's because I'm using these tools for some reason. Uh, so, back to points and faces. Let's have one there, one there. You notice that's not working. It's because I'm in the outside box. Uh, you just need to zoom a bit and we'll get to the inner one. Hopefully that will fill in in a moment. There we go. Ooh, ooh, there. These are a bit thin for my liking. I'm going to adjust them in a moment or two. Uh, but just for the moment, I want to get the uh, get the general idea going. Ooh. You'll excuse my moments of silence in terms of uh, concentrating and listening to Love Shack all at the same time. I'm not very good at it, basically. Okay. Well, whoops, I didn't want to do that. These aren't really working for me at the moment. Uh, I'm not completely sure how to get rid of them. Uh, although, if I do control, does that work? No, it doesn't. So I'm just going to use the uh, strokes tool through them to get what I want. Oh, oh got the first bit, didn't get the second bit, never mind. Oh, it's not happy, is it? Okay, well I think it's possibly because these uh, faces are uh, in my way a bit. That's really annoying. I hate it when that happens. Let's try quads, see if that works for us. Yeah, <laughs> not greatly. Uh, it's going all over the place. Right. Right, I'm just going to use the legendary undo keys to see if I can go back far enough to get rid of those dots because they're annoying me now. And then I'll do that just using the strokes bit by bit, as I probably should have done in the first place. There we go. That's much more sensible, isn't it? Oops, not what happened there. There we go. So that's more or less, you know, our base kind of ready for us to use symmetry on. Uh, there is some slight adjustments I want to do. Um, there's, this is all too close for my liking, so uh, I'm just going to make some adjustments. So when we subdivide this, I don't want there to be too many, uh, you know, disparities in mesh density across the whole thing. Uh, there are obviously places where you need more and there's places where you need a bit less. Uh, I like to make it 